everyone, I'm Olivia. And I am Jose. We are developers evangelists for TomTom. And today we want to prove to you that you can easily add a TomTom app to your website in 30 seconds or less. So the first thing you have to do is to go to developer.tomtom.com and let's download the SDK. We'll scroll down a bit to find the SDK for web and click here. Know that this is the latest released version 5. And if you click here, the download will start. This will download the distribution version. Open up this. And I'm going to copy it to a sp another folder. Rename it to SDK. And once we have it installed, can go back to the website and be in the documentation area. Let's see if we can find a tutorial basic example. Let's see the good example. The basic initialization, let's see the code. This is a super basic sample that will allow you to display a map view on your index page or wherever just from a simple copy paste. For example, we can copy this to the clipboard and after you have downloaded the SDK, uh, you can let's open a text editor. I'm using Sublime, for example, and we copy this uh, of code make sure that you have the style sheet from the SDK see the location of the SDK and the you have the cascade style sheets over there let's double check that in the SDK we have the CSS file here correctly and to execute this Let's see if I can go here. This is the location where I put my files and let's run the HTTP server. It opens a HTTP server in this URL. Now we are going to place the map inside a div. Let's call it the map, um, uh, this container with this ID. It's important to, to map it as a class map as well. You can add the script for the SDK right there. Put your API key, make sure it's, uh, it's assigned to the map object. Um, the container is the same ID of this div. The location of your SDK. Right now, I I am centering the map on Madrid, which is uh, the long a lot location here, using the basic map implementation, and it has to be vector. And I'm going to add at the end some navigation controls. You will see what I'm talking about. I save this file. Let's go to the browser. And if you haven't done already, I already started the HTTP server on that folder that I created it. And in the browser, just execute the local host and voila. So the map is already installed, but I realize that I'm zoomed in too far. Say, if I want to see more of Madrid, I want to zoom out. We'll go back to the editor and add the zoom level as a new line of code. And then let's save it and reload to see the new zoom. So as you can see, while this wasn't exactly 30 seconds, it was really quite fast. And you can see that the navigation control is the widget in the top right corner of the page to make adjustments to your view as needed. And that's it. On a quick note, if you go to developer.tomtom.com, we have all kinds of documentation and tutorials for our SDKs. Send us a note, or leave us some comments if you have questions or need help.
we'd be happy to hear from you. So everybody, thanks for watching and happy mapping.